Okay, hey guys, I'm uh, not doing a Buckyballs video today, but uh, this is basically a video response for uh, two household hacker videos I've seen. Um, I made it with one of those loudspeakers. If you check out uh, the household hacker channel, it looks basically the same. Um, I basically copied their idea with a few edits. Um, I took a 2x4 cut it to size. I You can make it any size you want. I just cut it so short because I only had this long of a drill bit because uh, in the video it requires you to drill right through here where I sealed with hot glue to here so then the speaker will go from your iPod out the loudspeaker. Um, I'm not going to show you how to make it. You can check out Household Hackers channel. Um, just like I said, this is a video response. Um, Basically, I edited it, so it made quite a bit difference, but I don't have the exact pieces they had. My hardware store only had these sizes, like household hackers are a bit bigger, and they got a little different design than me, but uh, I just got whatever I could. It's just copper piping, it's like a buck each, and I got like six pieces. Uh, I just glued, hot glued these together so they can't swivel. This one's pretty tight on there so I didn't. So I can take it off and turn it if I have to. And on the main base, I got this and I hot glued that in there too. And that's where the music will come out. Uh, the audio will go in here and go right through this hole. And um, I tried a few different techniques like a household hacker just has this, this setup. And they put their iPod in. And uh, that wasn't cutting it. It barely made any difference at all. So I tried a beer can, or any can, I guess. That's what I had laying around. I cut that up, and um, that barely made a difference. So then I found this funnel, which is very burnt. I accidentally lit on fire when I was trying to pour gas into something. And um, this fits perfectly on the top of this without even needing to seal it. Like it, it'll, it just fits perfectly snug and this worked quite a bit. Uh, I'll show you the difference here. We'll get it going. So this is what it sounds like with it or without it. I put it in you probably hardly notice a difference. There's a little bit. But not too much. And this is with the beer can. I didn't thought even bother attaching it because it didn't really make a big difference. See, there's not much of a difference there. But when I go ahead and put the funnel on, that fits perfectly. I'll redo that and you guys will notice a pretty crazy difference. And that's not even the loudest it goes. I can turn it up a little bit more. So it makes a pretty big difference with the funnel. Uh, I'll just do a little, take the funnel off and see the difference. I don't know if my camera picked that up, but it's pretty crazy how much uh, extra sound you can get out of that. Um, the hardest part, like you drill one hole and a 5 8 of an inch bit work perfectly to fit these copper pipe uh, size and uh, then you just drill a hole for the sound and then 
you're gonna drill a hole right through both of those to connect and then you just fill this hole after you can watch the household hacker video and uh, yeah it works pretty good if I'm on the fly and I need music without power I can use that um, like I said household hacker had bigger piping so I just tried to use the funnel and it made huge difference so maybe household hacker should try using the funnel to amplify it even more because it worked quite a bit for me and funnels have actually worked a lot for me I made this um, if you have seen another household hacker video they made that uh, homemade foghorn and normally if you take the funnel off that's what it is so they use the pill bottle or I had a film film canister they cut a piece of balloon stretch that out put the cap back on cut a hole right here to blow into another hole at the bottom with a straw coming out and that was pretty loud as it is and I decided to put a funnel on the end of it to echo and amplify it some more and uh, this is what it sounds like and I wasn't even blowing my hardest there. I don't know if that even picked it up, but um, yeah, the funnel made it work exceptionally, way more loud, I guess it was. But uh, yeah, definitely, if you're making one of these, put the funnel on it because it really helps with the sound.